Hey everyone, this is Lucky70x. Welcome back to Let's Play Cave Story Blind. In the last episode, we, uh, well, we, we bypassed the booster point eight, so we're now on track for the best ending, and then Curly was a badass, and we've made it to the Dark Zone. We're trying to escape the Labyrinth. Can we do it? We also have super missiles, so that's a cool thing, but, uh, we'll, we're just gonna move forward, and we're gonna figure out what happens from here, so that's the game plan. Let's see what happens. Are you, are you are you chilling with us now or okay no we're in the core by the way so that's a interesting thing but uh some kind of base huh okay so we need to figure out how to proceed we're in some sort of strange base I can't really seem to do much here except for probably operate this computer is Curly gonna be able to shoot with us or are we done pew pewing today open blast door sure is that could be a good thing or a bad thing Curly come back okay there's one of them is malfunctioning. Curly, come back! I need you to pew 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 if you're machine gun all over. I'm kind of curious to see how she fires when you... I guess if you give her the polar star, is her gun weaker? Is she, is she actually stronger if you let her keep her machine gun? Because that's actually an interesting point I didn't think about, but... uh, What are you what are you looking at? Okay, it only opened halfway. Okay. Is that is that a problem? Because, like, we, we managed to get through here. Is there going to be, like, some sort of something that happens? Or... Also, where do I go from here? I'm... Slightly, slightly confused. Wait, where do I have to go press the button again? Do I have to press the computer button again? Because I don't really see anywhere I could really go. Also, just out of curiosity's sake, let's check the map. There's a whole thing down there which I feel is going to be relevant to my interests, but uh, it doesn't seem like that big of an area, which is curious, I guess. Okay, is there anything I could do about said malfunctioning door? Because... Oh, I can shoot it, it seems. Okay, hang on, let me, let me, let me pew pew up something. Good. Oh, wait, is that actually... Like, it's actually, like, things are coming out of it. Yeah, there we go! Something broke free! What did I... Okay. Okay, it went up all the way. What was that all about? I'm really confused. Anyway. So the blast over here. Yeah, there's clearly something back there. It looks like a little, there's, like, broken robot pieces. I'm not sure how I feel about... All of that, but how do I, how do I break this? Then? I seem to need to get to go down there, which makes me wonder if now this is something I can get past or something. This is a really weird room. I'm a little, yeah. There we go. See, I I know what I'm doing. Yeah, I can go down there now. See, I have I have the smarts. I am I am a clever guy who can figure out all the puzzles, even when they just involve me talking to a computer and shooting a blast door several times. That blast door took so many shots, it was almost a little disconcerting. Slightly concerned about drowning, but I seem to be okay right now. It looks like I have to wait for the this to go all the way down, and then jump up here. Do this, open the blast door. I'm very... I have a really bad feeling about this area. Something just feels like... It feels like bad things are about to happen. And... I don't know, I, I have like the weirdest premonition right now. I feel like the game is, is setting up... I feel like Curly is being set up here, because we, we just had a section where she was super badass and we really liked her a lot. I feel like that's just stereotypical game about to do horrible things. This, this looks like a battle arena if I've ever... Ooh, what's down here? I see a shiny. I like shiny. Yeah! All right, we got a tow rope, whatever the heck that's used for. Okay, you guys know I looked at the things. You, you guys know that I know what's going on right now. I recognize, I, 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 I've, I have an idea here of what's going on. Don't fear, never fear. Lucky70x is a smart feller who don't need no, this just looks bad. This looks like boss incoming if I've ever seen it, that's for sure. All right, well, what are we doing now? Look! Uh, apparent, appears to be so. I want a cool helmet like that. That's awesome. Why do I have to look like freaking Ash Ketchum? Why did they give me the Ash Ketchum model when I could have been badass Cyber Soldier model? Well, these other ones are kind of lame, but whatever. I mean, probably that scary thing up in front. Or, okay, hey. Wow, you're like Terminator going on up in there. Okay, what target are we trying to eliminate? Okay. What were you trying to- Oh, that's bad. Oh, Curly? Well, cur good job, Curly! You're not very- Oh! Those are a lot of bullets. Yeah, that- Yep, that thing over here- Whoa! Hi, friend! Hello, friendo! 
You seem very ow. Oh, I'm gonna die so many times, aren't I? Uh, I'm not really doing any damage yet. Oh, Curly, you're back! Good! I want a boss so I can fight with you. That sounds like a good time. Okay, looks like I have to hit the, the blue part of it there. And also, me drowning seems like a really bad time. Can I have the air back? Okay, good. It, do it doesn't seem like that's too big of a concern. That'd be a little unfair. There's really nothing much I can do about this. This is an awesome boss, by the way. You get such a huge array to function in, which really works well with this style of gameplay. I can get all this health back, hopefully, which is nice. I'm gonna stick with my Polar Star right now, because... It does seem like it's actually fair, like... Okay, actually, no, I'm about to lose my polar... Oh, oh, currents, uh... I'm gonna switch to a better weapon if I can. I'm a little concerned of switching to this because, yeah, the level down is really easy, but... Uh... Yeah, that is... That is a scary bunch of things going on there. Okay, let me get back to that point. Oh, you know what? I totally forgot to get the tow rope. Is that gonna be bad? Let's go get the tow rope while I can. Okay, looks like I could just... Hi, boss! Don't mind me just coming down here to get a rope. There's a... Uh-oh. Is that bad that I can't get the rope? Ah, who cares? I'm probably gonna die anyway. But note to self, get the rope. It seems very relevant to my interest. And I hope I didn't have to get it beforehand. Hey, Curly, you're alive! Yay! Let's go kill a guy! Now, the Polar Star honestly seems not terrible here. Is there actually, like, merit to fighting from down here? I, it's hard to tell how exactly I want to be doing damage. And Okay, being down here just seems like a really bad time. Okay, I really seem to be needing to shoot the main body of it. Nothing else seems to be working. This this seems like a job for super missiles, honestly. In all honesty, I think I just need to go ham with missiles because they're they're upgraded. I just need a, I need a good chance. Like I need a way I need a way for it to turn blue. Okay, getting blown back here is not a good time. This is where I probably want to bust up the bub line and use the bub line to. Okay, those hurt. This is not an easy boss. Actually, if I was smart. I would just go back and save right now. Actually, I kind of want to make sure nothing else happens before I save, so... I'm okay of redoing this again if it means I have to, like... I don't know, just just in case... My gut, my gut intuition is telling me that it's not worth saving necessarily right now, so... Besides, I'm just gonna beat the boss right now! Clearly, oh, well, I just fell in the water, which is exactly where I don't want to be, because once you're down here, you're in a real bad spot. So basically, I suck! Okay, it seems like being back here is kind of safe, except not for too long, because the problem with super missiles is I really don't want to necessarily... Come on. T okay, that was effective at dealing a decent amount of damage. It's really hard to avoid taking hits, though. In this case, and it's really hard to jump. I can't, you, you can't really jump in the water that well. Okay, I need I need to have something defensive on when it's like that. So I need to be able to switch between offense and defense a lot better than that. Ah, damn it! Okay, apparently you can still blow me back. I guess this is even though I'm not in the. Oh god, yeah, that's the hit I don't want to be taking. This fight is really the water. Re like I'm, the water in this game really messes with me. I cannot handle the water. Okay, I didn't grab the, the tow rope again. Crap, I'm bad. Oh well, oh well, oh well, oh well. Okay, I need to wait for... Dang it, I keep falling down here. The, I hate bosses where I can I have to wait for it to open up while having a... Okay, I need the bub line. The bub line is my defensive weapon. I really need to keep it on as much as possible until I see his... Oh, what should I call it? Open up, in which case I can go pew pew a lot, deal a whole bunch of damage, and then I need to just find some place safe away from the big. I need to dodge the big bullets, so I need to get into a spot where I can really dodge the humongous bullets coming up. Curly, go, Curly! I've, I'm almost out of missiles anyway. Fireballs could be decent here. Uh, up on the top, eh, not really. Okay, I need it. Okay, just get a bubble shield going. Get a bubble shield going. There's like nothing I can do about that though. That's the problem. When it's like when it, when when I'm pinned up against the wall, how do I deal with that? And I would like to use my sword here too, but it seems oh, I can destroy the arms. Okay. I need to focus on destroying the arms. I don't know why I didn't think of that first, but that's a thing I can do. Okay, new strategy. We're going to go for killing the arms as much as possible here. The strategy being hopefully to Get, yeah, get to these arms and just use the sword here because the sword can cut through a whole lot of the stuff here. And then hopefully just get to destroy as many of these arms as I can 
Just get an offensive going right here, right now. Yeah, this seems to be a lot more effective right now. Because I'm getting a lot of damage on the arms. Hopefully, if the big bullets come, I'll have more room to dodge. Just kind of keep an offensive on until the sword runs out of the ability to be on the offensive. And then, we will act accordingly. But for now, I'm going to the king sword. Okay, I've lost a lot of my sword ability, but if I can get this shiny... There we go. Got it back. Yeah, as long as I can keep on the offensive, it seems like I'm okay. And it's... Okay, this is the problem right now. Okay, I'm going to actually stay... Uh, uh, wait, just kind of let, yeah, get over here, use those as, yeah, so I can head back right there to get some, uh, some distance so I can ha have the ability to dodge those big bullets, because those are the things that just massacre me. I'm in a situation where I really want to switch to the sword, but I don't really have the opportunity to do that quite yet. Okay, I'm at a position where I can start pushing back. This is all about, this is a battle entirely about pushing him back. Jumping there was a terrible decision, except I can still kind of deal decent things down here. Yeah, this is still okay. This is still okay. I can fight down here. I can fight down here okay. I can fight down here okay. Just gotta keep pushing him back. You gotta keep pushing him back. This is a, a battle of endurance. This strategy seems infinitely more effective right now. I'm still getting, I'm actually getting a lot of HP where I can keep my HP numbers up too. This almost becomes a war of attrition of all the projectiles and stuff you get. Except you can drown! I forgot you can drown! Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it! Okay, okay. I have a strategy that works, just don't fall down the- Wow, that's a bad start. That's a really bad start. That's a really bad start. That is an exceptionally awful start. Losing experience on my sword this early is pretty- yeah, well, Okay, so the experience stays up there, but I don't. I don't think- that that's a little weird to me, honestly. Hopefully I can take this opportunity to get a little bit of experience back somehow? Really need to get this experience back for my weapon here. Just a little bit more experience. That's all I need. I, can, I, I still seem to be okay. There we go. Okay, now I can start with the pushing back. We can push him back. We can just push him back. So I do not want to stay down there. I will drown really easily down there. And that just is a bad time. Okay, I'm being blown back. I want to get some sort of progress here so I can quickly keep moving forward. Dodge all the stuff here that I now need to get back up on a higher level. Because I need the height, the more high, the higher I am, the better it seems. That was almost terrible, but it seems like I'm still okay. I do need to get, like I said, back up on the higher area, because if not, I'm going to drown really quickly, and drowning is obviously not in my best interest. That's something I sort of failed to do, but I am really losing ground here, and that is very concerning. I'm going to try to just jump up here and really just get the DPS going here as much as possible. Push him back. This seems to be the spot where I can make my stand here. At some point, I'll bust out missiles and hope that the missiles will... Come on, give me... Exp there we go, level up. I'm just literally sitting here spamming my 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 sword here. Sword is a beautiful weapon. I'm kind of considering missiles as well right now, but... Okay, I need to focus on dodging the big stuff. Seems like moving forward there is how you do that. Okay. At least I've gotten better at dodging out. Okay, that's okay. Taking a little bit of damage there, that's no issue. No problem. No, I'm not concerned. Just continue with the DPS here. The deeps. Get the big deeps going. Push him back. Wait, what? I was on the second level! Damn you, drowning! Damn you! Alright, you know what I like? Not drowning. That sounds like a good time, so... Wow, let's not lose my ability to have a good sword right at the beginning again. Because that did not go well last time. There we go, though. Got my sword back. Just gonna, I seem to just like, it, just like it down here. Although, I might need to really stick to the higher ground at some point. Because, well, as we've seen, not having the high ground does seem to be detrimental at some point. So, because uh, I did run out of air quite a few times. Even on the middle level, which I was kind of not focused on air at that point. Because I was like, oh, I can't run out of air at that point. No. Also, I have to be having the arms thing seems so much helpful. Curly, what are you doing? You're just over there, Curly. Just not giving it a crap. Jeez. Stop being such a badass, Curly. It's it's really concerning, actually, because that generally implies that you're going to have a bad time real soon. Uh-oh. Ah, oh, damn it. I was hoping I could still dodge that. and It just was not meant to be. I do not want to be down in this lower area, but it does seem like the... I have some time to get back up to the upper area. I want to try to get some HP and experience back, if possible. Although now I'm getting really concerned about the whole drowning. Th I'm gonna drown. I'm gonna drown. There's, there's no avoiding drowning here. Okay. 
Like, am I just bad? Or is this boss actually really difficult? I, I, it's hard for me to tell, really. I think I'm just bad. I mean, I do tend to be pretty bad at this style of gameplay. But, uh, maybe, maybe it's just me. Maybe, maybe I'm just terrible. That's, it's very possible, I mean. I've never, I've never touted myself as the best of gamers, except for the times when I brag, and then I do. But, shh, no one needs to know this. Okay, just sitting here with King seems to once again still be the most effective strategy. It's until he blows me is the problem, and... Don't put that, that, don't, no, don't. I know, I just said the blow word. You don't have to mention that, it's okay. But, like, this seems to be fairly effective still. I just need to find a way to keep in the situation, because this seems to be the spot to be, to really have some sort of, you know, ability to do stuff. Although, this is the part where he's going to shoot the balls, I'm just going to back this way instead, because trying to stay forward and then dodging back is probably more effective just because, okay, I don't know if I want to go there necessarily. Not until I have a level 3 again. Okay, now I have a level, well, I had a level 3. Keyword had. Now, hopefully this will still come, the, 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 I'll still get the water back in time where I won't drown. Okay, yeah, it seems to be okay. I don't know why I drowned that one time. It was really unfortunate, but, uh, as long as I can kind of just hold him at a standstill here. Maybe I should start busting out the, you know what, I feel like, I'm feeling confident if the missiles. I'm going to wait for him to... Just kind of do this and then kind of just bust out a whole bunch of that because I'll get a bunch of missiles as I'm fighting him down here now that's the that's the the theoretical game plan oh he is pushing me back right now which means bad things are coming so move forward dodge all the things move back I do need actually give me a little bit of experience just one little one little there we go okay level three let's head back here before he advances too far because obviously if he advances all the way I imagine I will be all sorts of dead in fact oh wait the the air! How is this even fair? How are you supposed to win when you cannot... The... How is that even... It's up longer than I can even do a thing with! This episode is literally going to be devoted to this boss, I get the feeling. I've already been recording for like a half hour on this one boss. It's actually kind of a little absurd. This guy is... I don't know if I'm just like fundamentally strategizing wrong here or what, but the drowning thing is kind of bullshit. I, ha I told you guys, I did, I, th I remember explicitly saying, hey, at some point the whole drowning thing, I'm sure is gonna be bullshit in this game. And lo and behold, at some point the drowning was kind of bullshit in this game. Come on, open your... Yeah! Look at your bright little eyes. I hope you enjoy a whole bunch of missiles in your face! Okay, now let's get back, let's get the experience back to level up and hold them off here as much as we can. Okay. I'm going to try to get some sort of forward momentum. As soon as I see the pew pew balls, I'm going to run the other way. And then try to get back up here as quickly as possible. Dang it! The stupid... Any sort of water completely kills your ability to jump, and it's really unfortunate. Okay, this is the point where I want to get the high ground, because apparently I just need the high ground, or we're just going to have a bad time. But unfortunately, it's really hard to keep the high ground, because it's hard for me to... I, I, I It just functions so much better on the middle ground there. Meanwhile, I'm losing so much time here, which is really bad. Okay, this is a spot where I can hold my ground, though. I can really hold my ground here with this. So, just, like I said, holding my ground, I'm gonna hold my ground, I'm gonna hold my ground, get, get some missiles back in the process. Hopefully I won't just drown randomly, because that was bullshit. Actually annoyed that that happened. Uh, I have, oh, I only have three missiles. Okay, that's okay, he's doing the, the he's about to do the balls and... No, no, and no. Okay, get this back. Super missiles, just to blow them back, I guess. I have a little bit of super missiles. What am I doing? What am I doing now? Okay, priority number one is to get air. Priority right now is to focus only on getting air. Okay, I can breathe. I've leveled down, sure. I'm actually a little bit low on HP. It's a little concerning. I've lost a lot of momentum here, but I feel like I could still... Oh god, oh god, this could go really bad or really good. I'm gonna go on the, it went really good angle, I think. I'm feeling like that went okay. That health is really gosh darn tempting. In fact, I'm gonna, well, that was not worth it. Because I forget, like, why, how can you, can ju how do you jump worse? How do you jump worse in a, oh god, he's about to shoot the bullets. I'm gl thank goodness for invisibility frames, I would have died. Oh god, this was a mistake, this was a mistake, this was a mistake, except it really wasn't! Okay, come on, come on, fight back, fight back, fight back, fight back. 
Really run, run, running low on HP. I try to get this health okay. I'm still doing okay though. This is actually this is feeling like a good run. This is feeling like a good run. This is feeling like the, the run where I want to get my sword back. Sword is friend. Where's the air? Okay, there's the air. Okay, see, it does seem like as long as I stay in the middle for a long enough, I think I just probably like went up and just timed my ascent really poorly and wasn't able to get air as a result, but this seems to be a war of attrition that works out fairly okay. And I can't complain about that. Actually, it's worth my time to come down here and get some sort of health there. Although, actually, it wasn't really... Oh, shoot, he's blowing me back. That means the balls are coming. Oh, God! No! <sighs> that was close. I was a little scared there. Not gonna lie. Sorta panicked just a little bit. Okay, continue the fight. He's almost dead. I got this. I got this. I do believe... I do believe in the power of low god. I need air. I need air. I need air. Give me air. Thank you. Just gung ho. Gung ho. Gung ho. Gung ho. Oh god, that was a scary fight. Hey, it's you. Oh, the heart of the island was this. Did we just destroy the island? Cause that's awesome. Yep, that's misery. She's rude. Oh, yeah, Curly is kind of motherly if you think about this. This is the reason- what? Hey! That's racist towards robots. Well, looks like we've destroyed the island. Yep, let's do it! We're going to destroy everything! Hey, doctor! Are you upset? Oh. Okay, she's- so they're going to save the core here. Okay, they've saved the island for now, but we've dealt them a pretty hefty blow there. Also, I did forget to pick this up. Hopefully it doesn't matter? Ayo, we can still get it. Okay. That would have really sucked, but god damn, that was a scary fight. Also, I really want to make sure I don't drown. Can you share some of your... Oh my god, where is the... Where? No! No! Hang on! How is this fair? Wait, did I get screwed? Did I screw up because I didn't talk to... What's your face? Did I have to talk to Curly there? Hang on, now I'm concerned. Who? Uh, who's Balas and who's Jenka? Okay, I can breathe. Okay. Oh, oh no! You saved me if you're your air bubble. Yeah, I'm gonna use the tow rope. Okay. Okay. I think, I I think I'm pretty sure everything's okay. Uh, I'm fairly sure I'm still on track for everything that's important. Because I knew there was something involved in that tow rope and curly. That that's what I've read. Was there something involving a rope and curly? Game! Don't make me panic like that! Gosh! You scared the bejeebus out of me there! I was really, really concerned that I just Scott had to do the whole fight again. Oh, don't do that, game. Okay, I'm assuming when you, if you talk to Curly, she'll just be like, I don't know what to do, but yeah, we have Curly's air bubble now. Do we have, like, an actual thing in here? Yeah, we have Curly's air tank! Yay! Except Curly might die, so that's no! I don't want Curly to die. I like Curly. She's pretty cool. Can I actually go forward? It does not seem like I have the ability to do anything here. I can't seem to make this jump. So I'm going to assume I have to go back. And I'm going to tentatively save because that... Okay, no. There's more going on here. So I can't go back that way anymore. So the question is, where do I go from here? And the answer is... I'm not sure. But I do have Curly, and that's what's important, I think. I'm fairly sure. The save point's down here now. How weird. I do have a file backed up before this save. So, if everything went horribly wrong and I did a horrible thing... Can I go in this thing now? I can! Oh. There's like a whole thing going on over here. Now, the thing is, I'm not sure how much footage I'm cutting out and how much I'm keeping. I'm going to... This area looks pretty big and pretty involved, and I want to make sure and double check that I actually didn't script the best ending by doing all that. So, this is actually the last episode I'm recording before I go to MAGFest. So, I'm gonna let you guys, I'm gonna catch up with the comments, I'm gonna make sure everything I've done so far is, is all good, and I didn't mess anything up, and we're gonna do the waterway in the next episode. So, probably a short episode, I'm probably have to piece together a sort of montage of me failing that boss, because he really kicked my butt. But, uh... I think I'm gonna call things here, hopefully. 
So that's the game plan. So Lucky70X signing out. See you all in the next episode for more Cave Story Blind. Bye-bye.